Welcome to the workshop. Uh, what we have here, or what we're going to do today, is I'm going to etch these initials into this Yeti cup. Uh, this is my test piece, and you can see there a few places that I've just kind of played with it. So we're going to etch this, and it's going to look a little bit better on the other. So to do this, we're going to have salt water, cotton balls, and a six volt battery. So what we're going to do first is take the positive side, yep, the positive side, hook a wire to the positive side and a wire to the negative side. The positive side will go on the workpiece. So I'm just going to tape that wire to the workpiece. Now. I've attached the other wire to my pliers. So what we're going to do here is I'm going to soak a cotton ball, kind of dip it down in the salt water, because salt water conducts electricity better than just regular tap water. What's your mix? It's just a little salt, not uh, two or three shakes, half a teaspoon maybe. Um, just a, a little is plenty. So. I'm going to put this cotton ball into my pliers and kind of clamp down. I'm going to cover all exposed metal with cotton. Because what, I, what we're trying to do here, this is a lot like um, welding. It's basically DC welding. Instead of adding material, I'm going to absorb material and spread the arc out over this cotton ball. So. As I do it, I'm going to just roll it in, leave it there for a couple of seconds, move down, just keep rolling. And if you look close, it's just starting to eat away at the material. That's going to eat away a lot, and that's why that turns yellow. That's that stainless steel coming out. And it takes, this will take about 20, 30 minutes to do. Just have to be real consistent on your laying out of your, uh, your cotton ball because it's going to, you want it to be as consistent a removal as you can everywhere. And if you listen closely, you probably can't hear it on the video, but you'll hear it start to sizzle. That's the water evaporating, or the electricity turning the water into vapor. Kind of sounds like bacon frying a little bit. More like bacon frying in another room. Doesn't smell like it, though. Okay. Okay, so I've made about four passes over this, just doing the same technique. Just kind of rolling it in letting it squeeze out, listen to it sizzle, move along. So you can see the cotton balls here when they get kind of a yellowish, move on to another one. So I've been through three, four of them on this one piece. So I pulled the battery off of it. So I'm going to peel back. This is a uh, a stencil made out of vinyl. So as I peel it back, you can see that everywhere the the battery was, it left, or actually took out a little bit of material. even gets really finite lines like that one. You'll see another one up here at the top. Like that little tiny line right there. I don't know if you can see it right in there. Go back that way.
And that's it. It's in there forever. <laughs>